let's see how to make a color code converter from HX to RGB and from RGB to HX. Let's start. First, declare a variable named set which contains the input from the user of the color code. And give a function to the input called strip to erase the excess of space bar between the front and the back. And another conclusion named lower to or make all the letters in the color code small trace. Declare a variable named code. It contains the value of the color. This is used to later change the value with a function that involves for loop. Now we have to see if the set contains a comma because if RGB, RGB colors contain a comma. Then if it contains a comma, then the code value changes into RGB. Now we declare a dictionary which contains all the values uh, of the hexadecimals we would require later in this code. Declare a dictionary con where the values will be returned. 1 will be equal to 1 itself, 2 will be equal to 2 itself, 3 will be equal to 3 itself, 4 will be equal to 4 itself, 5 will be equal to 5 itself, 6 will be equal to 6 itself, 7 will be equal to 7 itself, 8 will be equal to 8 itself, 9 will be equal to 9 itself, but 10 will be but 10 will be equal to string A and 11 will be equal to string B. Make sure it's uppercase. 12 will be equal to string C. 13 will be equal to string D. 14 will be equal to string T. 15 will be equal to string F. 16, which is uh, unwanted, unwanted number, we will not be required in 16, but even though you can set the value of 16, G. When the dictionary is declared, we will be we will define a function named def to hex, which will be required to convert RGB into hex. First, in a try in a try void, we will be running all the necessary code that will be, we will be required. First, declare a variable while and that will be equal to set dot split comma. We are uh, putting this function to separate all the numbers between the commas if a RGB number is inputted. Declare a variable t1, which will be containing string float while index 0 we will be close the float and that will be divided by 16 i will explain later why then 16 and the total str will be split by the comma sorry full stop this will be done to split the numbers if it is a decimal number now we declare variable b1 is equals to dictionary con value int and it will be the t1 index 0 and v2 will be dictionary con value int float 0 point plus t1 index 1 into 16 now vice versa we will create more values uh, which will be having the same format of calculations but with the increasing index number this is the same type we used earlier and same calculations but the index of the values and the variables are changed you can refer this code from here to write it then if all this condition means we will be printing print then the value of h e x is equal to hash and then we will write v1 v2 v3 v4 v5 and v6 then we will be if all these condition doesn't meet we would have to write a except method except method which will be print please check your code once again because it seems to be wrong then the code and the, the definition of 2x will be confirmed and now we have to create another function that we convert hx to rgb now we will write define do r rgb and use a try method this 
trying to get we will we will be first of all we will be converting this value into opposite like here 11 is equals to b but we want b is equals to 11 so for doing this we will be writing an function where the variable con 2 will be equal to dictionary and which will be equal to str of b which is the second value str of b is equal to k which is first value for for k in for k and also v in con which is our variable dot items then this will be reverse values of the con dictionary and store it in the con2 value now we would have to write a h1 which is a set so which we will be requiring a set name h1 then we will be writing a for loop uh, b in set uh, set which is the input uh, we expected from the user and h1 which is set dot append b and this uh, this follow up is however just because to make the to convert the str in str sorry str in the set to be a index because we cannot to split method to directly convert str into a separate separate set so i use this method for convenience so now we will be declaring n1 is equals to n1 is equals to int dot con con2 value h1 index 0 index 0 into 16 we will close the int and plus int and plus int con2 value h1 index 1 and close the bar now this is a function uh, where we will take the int con2 uh, and the index 1 will be a number or a string if it is a b c or d or f that it will convert to 11 12 13 14 15 respectively but if the con value is 1 2 3 6, 4 9 the values will be the values will remain same then we'll extend this code similarly with the uh, upcoming indexes to the values n1 n2 and n3 uh, after finishing writing this we will be writing if all the conditions meet then we will write print <coughs> print rgb value is equal to rgb plus rgb uh, bracket plus n1 sorry n1 and string comma 2 set the comma between the rgb which we usually do and n2 and n3 <coughs> then after finishing this if the conditions doesn't meet or if any uh, error occurs in the code then except method will be functioning then we will be right print something is wrong please check the h a x code input i uh, sorry write just the co correct code so input i carefully after writing this uh, our function is finished and now we have to uh, we have to if the value of color code is equal to hex we have to run this this uh, function but if the color code will be rgb then we have to run this function to do this at last uh, after running all of the above code we will be writing if code is equals to rgb then execute to h a x but as if as if code is equals to h e x then execute to rgb if uh, any occur any error occurs which uh, which is 100% not able to occur because only the two values h x and rgb but if anyone interrupts with the code or something else happens then the, it will not uh, show any of these two then it will print something is wrong unable to convert Your function your code is finished and now you can run this code so no. checking this let's now run the code but as you can see the id doesn't accept input files in this version so we have to change the id to get an another change the id input and uh, return this text but now uh, let's run this code and see what happens we have run this code it is asking us to enter the color for example we will write e8 eia e8 yep e now let's run and we got exact rgb value but we will write this rgb value to convert it to hex it's 138, 168 and 250 
now let's see 138 168 and 250 now we have got exact hx value and let's see if you can convert any other color code into the exact rgb and hx value so now i hope this video has helped you and if you want to check out the code it is in the description here we will see why i have written this code here i have converted the index of the val 0 which will be the first number in the rgb value and we will divide it by 16 to get a decimal number in that we will separate the decimal number by the pull stop using the split and uh, we will get the first uh, first index of the splitted number and we will uh, divide it uh, divide it with the 16 and we will uh, put it in the converter and if it is above 10 it will be converted to the str and if it is below 10 it will be remains the same number but uh, to the decimal number we have uh, in the index 2 we will multiply it with 16 and we'll get a number and we'll use con dictionary to get the value if it's a number it will stay a number but if it exceeds 10 then it will come to the string a b c d e f g respectively now let's see why we use this to convert to rgb here it is very simple than the before hx because in this we will take the number uh, we will take the value of the hx in and it, there will be six values totally and we will take the first index and we will multiply it with 16 and take the second index uh, we will uh, firstly convert it into the number uh, hexadecimal using the con2 and we will take the first index multiply it with 16 and add the second index con and we'll get the answer